What three objections are always on the minds of your prospective client or audience whenever you're trying to sell a product, service, or idea? The answer to that question will be found in your next Daily Dose of Public Speaking Wisdom. I've been very fortunate in my career. I've had some great mentors and teachers in the area of sales and also speaking. One of the most important lessons I learned about speaking is that when you're in speaking, you're in sales. You're selling ideas. It's no different than selling a car or a toaster or an online product. You're just doing it from stage to a group of people. Well, in order to sell your idea or a product or service on stage, you have to overcome at least one of three objections that is on the minds of your audience. They believe they either lack time, money, or skills, or a combination of those three. So how do you overcome this? Here's an example. For my new online course, Stand Up, Speak Up, Stand Out, I promote the idea that number one, as far as the time objection, you can do this on your own time. It's self-study. For the money objection, I tell people it's not an expensive course. For If you give up a one cup of Starbucks a day for 30 days, you can buy the course. And as for the objection of lack of skill, that's the purpose of the course, to give you the skill. So on your own time, with a reasonable amount of money, you can develop the skill. Think about that as you're putting your next presentation together. If you're selling an idea, if you want people to take an action to buy something, sign up for tips, or just buy into an idea. How are you overcoming that internal objection that they may never be voicing, but they are thinking, I don't have enough time, money, or skill. Do that, and you'll much more likely sell your idea, product, or service. How are some ways that you have overcome objections from your audience and sold your idea? Leave your comments below, and I look forward to seeing you on our next Daily Dose of Public Speaking Wisdom.